Good morning. What's up? Hi. Hi. Oh my god. We, what time is it? 5.56 in the morning. We, we'll go at 5. And we're going to Lubbock, Texas. Let the record show, I was up and ready first. <laughs> yeah, he was. Um, this is Corey, my best friend. That's her boyfriend, Wyatt. Adam's in the bathroom. And we're about to go to Lubbock to get a dog, which is super exciting. We get her tomorrow, but we had to go drive and pick her up today. Um, because it's, er, we pick her up tomorrow, but we have to go drive and get there today because it's like, sorry, it's so early. Because it's like an eight hour drive. Um, so we're staying in a hotel tonight. So we asked some friends to come and we're gonna eat dinner and hang out tonight. I literally didn't sleep at all last night because I was so excited. So that's what's going on right now. We we're getting a doggy. We're getting a baby dog. Are you excited? Are you excited? Huh? <laughs> I just realized I had two hats on. Oh my god. So yeah, we just packed up the car. I have a huge whole entire bag for her of random stuff, probably way too much. But since it's such a long drive, I bought like I brought like a bunch of towels and cleaner and stuff because <laughs> y'all are so weird. Because um I feel like she might get car sick and throw up a couple times. So she'd be a girl after my own heart because I get car sick too. But yeah, that's what's going on. We're about to leave, go to Starbucks, and then be on the way. I will update you guys in a little bit. Uh, okay. Uh, Don't cuss. I know, I'm just kidding. Okay. We made it to our hotel. It's like kind of not like the nicest hotel, which I didn't really realize, but it's okay. We're only here for a night. <laughs> um, we are out, the boys are gonna go get some beverages. Um, and we're gonna go, Corey and I. Love it, love it, love it! <laughs> We've never been to Lubbock before. We're obviously very excited. Um, we get the dog in the morning. I didn't vlog on the car ride because it was just really long and we were just chilling. But we're here, the boys are gonna go get some beverages, and then Corey and I are gonna get ready, and I think we're gonna go to Chimmy's and hang out, and then go to dinner, and then come back to the hotel room. Wyatt, I'm using that lighting to vlog. <laughs> My bad, kid. So that's the plan, it's just gonna be a casual night. I mean, I guess none of the bars are really open, other than Chimmy's, because it's a restaurant too. So, just super casual. Um, it's like a college town, so I guess we're just gonna see what we can get into. Look at my hair. What is happening? Don't you eat gay girls? <laughs> <laughs> well, if Wyatt was still single, I would shout you out, but he is fully oh taken, ladies. By who? I don't see nobody. Oh. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's what's going on. We're excited. It's almost puppy time, people. Okay, we just got ready. The lighting is terrible. Say yeah. hi, babe. It just takes money to get me a talk on here. Okay. Um, we're going we're going to Chimmy's. Um, if you don't know what that is, it's like a bar restaurant thing. And then we're probably gonna go like eat actual dinner somewhere else, but we're just gonna go hang out at Chimmy's. For a little bit. Cheers. Cheers. You look beautiful. Is this, are you zoom in? I don't even know how to zoom in in this. It's okay, I can come up to you. Oh, okay, good. Oh my god. This we can't we can't leave anywhere in an efficient matter with both of the boys. It's just like literally impossible. Oh man. Hello, babe. Can you turn the music down some? We are on our way to get the puppy. Good morning, uh, ladies. Yeah, it's really early. It's like 7:30. We got up. Well, I've been up, oh god. I've been up since 7:45 or 7:45. 4:45. Four <laughs> I did not sleep at all because I was so excited and honestly I just like did not sleep good. So I've been up for a minute. Um, we went to Chick-fil-A and we got breakfast and we had to drive like an hour to the breeder's house. Um, so we're probably like 15-ish minutes away and we had to pick out our puppy. I'm so excited. We have to choose from like seven different ones so that's going to be kind of overwhelming. Um, and then we'll drive back home, and I think we're all very tired today. So sleepy. Yeah. Um, but we drove yesterday, us girls, and now the boys.
guys are driving today. So we're stuck in the back seat. So that's what's going on. But I'm not gonna film like picking out the puppy just because I feel like there's gonna be like a lot happening. So I'll just show like once we actually find like figure out which one we want and like get back in the car. wasn't super interested in us and then this one just kind of came in and like stole the show for us she keeps like look at her oh my god hey, girl. i'm obsessed with her she's so soft she smells like a puppy she's the fluffiest thing i've ever seen i wanted a fat fluffy puppy and i got her we're so excited and the people were so kind this first time we'd met them they were so so sweet so now we just have a long drive Home. I'm hoping she doesn't get car sick, but we brought stuff to be prepared for that. Look at her little jail. Are you kidding? She's so cute. Okay, we gotta get it from this angle. Obsessed with her. I mean, just oh my look God. at that. <gasps> look at the face. <laughs> She's so cute. I'm obsessed with her. Like, literally, I don't even need kids anymore at this point. <laughs> I just need dogs. <laughs> Are you excited? Yeah. Why? How do you feel, buddy? It's exciting. <laughs> how do you feel? I'm an ant of a dog. <laughs> Um, 
they said Jesse um, was the calmest one in the whole litter, like has been the calmest one the whole time. And she just like has like such like poise to her, they said. But like we were able to take her inside, out of just Adam and I, like away from distractions and away from her litter. And she was also like super playful and cuddly, which is like exactly what I wanted. There was one dog, you guys. So the way it worked is like, we were on a wait list and we were the first pick for a girl. So there was 10 puppies, there were seven girls and then the rest were boys. And so we got to pick from seven puppies and so it was really overwhelming at first, but there was one, oh my God, we call her orange because she had an orange collar on. She was literally insane. She was running around like a crazy dog and she was so cute and playful, but like, of course Adam liked her and I was like, absolutely not. Like even the breeders were saying like the mom, Ellie, always has to like discipline her and like get her to chill out. And they were like, yeah, she's definitely like the most playful one in the litter, which is fine. But like, I can't have a crazy dog. She was like insane. And she was like biting your hands and stuff a lot, which I didn't really like. So that was our experience. They were super nice. Why am I like holding this right here? They were super nice. And they gave us a lot of coffee and they had like a really cute little like fire pit going. And um, cause where we're at this morning, yeah, it was like 25 degrees this morning, probably even colder. I think the feels like was like 20. So, so it was literally so cold, but yeah, we got six hours to go until we're home. I'm really nervous to introduce her to Kitty, but hopefully it'll be okay. I just hope that they get along. Okay, we just stopped for lunch and now we're back on the road. We had a subway and it was just so good. I feel so much better. I was getting so tired and like having a headache almost and I needed to eat so bad. Hello. She's the queen. She wants the attention. Do you see us now? Yeah, hello, my name's Jessie. So I was gonna show you guys here. Let me just flip it around. Adam's back here in the backseat with me now being on dad duty. But she took her first pee with us, which is so good. And we got her this really cute little collar with this little dog tag, which is so cute. You're so pretty. And um, she was actually playing for a little bit earlier. This is like the most she's been awake since we got her. I think she's kind of getting used to us. Um, she loves this platypus. And then the breeder was so sweet. She really liked this toy, so she gave it to us. And you can like put treats and stuff in it. So cute. She loves her dad. And Subway. And Subway. Yeah, we let her have a taste of our Subway. She's so perfect, you guys. She's literally, whenever we get home, I'll like set it up and like show you how big she is. Because she's like, she's pretty big. Like, we're saying she has to be like 15 pounds at least. She's a chunk. Which is funny because she was actually, um, one of the smaller ones of the litter. Like there was like the runt and then she was, the runt was the smallest and then she was like the second smallest. Um, and the breeder was saying like they would have to like put the other puppies somewhere else and like just let the runt and her specifically nurse on the mama, I guess, to make sure they were getting enough milk. And now she's like one of the biggest ones, which is hilarious. But, and her paws are big. Like she's gonna be a big girl and she's full grown. We're so excited and we love her so much. Everybody pray for us. <laughs> So the cat and the dog. 
Oh God, don't oh. get her out from under there. Oh, she's going under the couch. <laughs> well, the cat and the dog, they had their first reunion. Okay, stop. <laughs> and they... She got her first bath. We've been hanging out, exploring. She loves her bed. She loves to play with her ball. Her and Kitty, I don't even know where Kitty is. I don't think they're really bothered by each other, but they're like also, they don't really care about each other and they're not super interested in each other. She's kind of whiny. I think she just like wants attention all the time. Um, and she's like a little shadow. Like she just like follows you around. But she's very playful now that we're home. And she went potty outside. We haven't had any accidents yet. Nothing, no accidents in the car. She's done so good. Oh, what's that? What's that? 